Hey, this is Swaggers doing L.A. Noir for GameGuideCentral.com. And this is Case 2, A Marriage Made in Heaven on the Traffic Desk. And uh, we're doing a lot of stuff at Game Guide Central. Check us out for L.A. Noir. We have collectible videos, uh, you know, landmarks, the uh, golden films, um, the badges, everything. We also got full mission walkthroughs. And then we also have cut up achievement guides if you're just looking for a little achievement help. So when this mission starts, you'll talk to some officers as you always do, and then let's uh, let's look at this body. And you need to uh, check his pockets. And there you go. You will find a insurance policy. What the what? Has life insurance. I mean, I guess I don't understand why he's that mad. If his base policy was ten thousand, I mean, it just went up six thousand dollars. You know, whatever. Now let's check his other pocket, his right on your left, to look at his wallet, and you just need to uh, check out, you know, let's check him, he doesn't have much money. Kind of awkwardly sticking out there too, but that's not really anything. We just want to check his ID, find out who he is. Ah, yes. There you are. Next of kin. That's who you are. Lester. Ah, you're dead, dude. Let's just put that back. What have you got on and then uh, talk to the coroner, reports, he was and he'll give you a little more uh, information. And then you can check out all these other uh, clues. They're not necessary. Uh, to five star, they're not considered actual clues. Good Twenty feet. More like just little informational tips, you know, extra story stuff for you to peruse. So there's three of those, and then we're also going to get a case-specific achievement here called Stab Right. And uh, we'll get to that in a second. What what it is, just finding it on the first uh, first run through. And if you somehow miss it, if you're watching this after you've started this case, you can go into cases from the main menu and redo the case uh, and get that achievement. So now we're going to go into this alleyway and find this knife. And it's just right here, right in this first trash can. And then do the little left stick manipulating, which I find to be horrible. There, oh, 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 there we go. There we go. So we'll actually pop that achievement. It's for finding it in the first crime scene, but I guess you don't pop it until you actually know what happened. You know, what, what the significance of the knife is. Looks like the significance is a lot of stabbing, but you know, whatever. So let's go talk to the witness. And, you know, first order business. And uh, she's telling the truth there. Good for her. Second order of business, suspect vehicle. And uh, she is telling the truth again. Did you, see the license plate? you don't get that. You don't get that kind of honesty, any, you know, very much anymore. And then finally, the argument overheard. That's all. Uh, that one we're going to doubt. I, mean, I, don't, I don't think she's uh, being forth, forth with, with us. And that was correct. And so now we're going to go inside and talk to the bartender and try to get a little, couple more facts. A couple more facts in this case. There's Dudley. I'm Detective Phelps of the home. What can you So the first, I think he's being honest with us. This first bit. No, doubtful. I'm gonna doubt him. It's against license, pretty I think he knows more than he's letting on. And then association with the victim. Yeah, he was. And he's telling the truth that time. That time he's telling the truth. Good for him. And the argument overheard in the bar. No. No, I don't think so. Doubt. We don't have any evidence, but I doubt him. So that's going to add the uh, joint business venture. How long the drinks? And that we're going to doubt that too. That doesn't seem kosher. I don't think. I don't think he's being forth wit with us. And then there is a newspaper right there. We want to get that newspaper. Again, I'm not showing you the scenes because Rockstar is pretty, pretty hardcore about not letting people, not wanting cut scenes and videos. That's fine. That's their prerogative. They want you to play the game. And I'm not here to make a movie for you. I'm here to give you a guide so that when you play it, you get everything. You get your five stars. Now uh, let's go back. Uh, actually, we need to go back and go into the. Um, back and talk and use the phone and that'll get us an uh, address
And from there we're going to leave and we're going to go to the Shelton Residence. And then uh, Shelton's going to make a run for it. we got to take him out. Um, just hit him. I couldn't get, you know, they say your partner will fire at his wheel at the wheels, and I find he only fires at people who are firing back at you. So just chase him down. You have to be careful with the damage you do. Any damage you do, even in these pursuits, uh, you know, when you the are the law, that counts against you. So we're just trying to take him out. If you don't take him out before he gets to the station, all he does is he gets out and uh, runs at a door and just stands there. So... Uh, you can't get away from you as long as you, you know, keep pretty close. And just uh, try to bash him from the side to get his, uh, you want to get his wheel well destroyed. Ooh, whoops, sorry. Sorry, mister. And boom! Oh, that's good, that's good, that's gonna be the end of it. That's gonna be the end of it. That's it! Cuff him and we're done. So go and arrest him. Give it up, LAPD! Give it up, LAPD! It's a vehicular manslaughter rap sound, Shelton. I hit him. Yeah, oh, in Dave. your face. And then we're going to flash forward to uh, the Patterson residence. And we're having a conversation with her, and the first thing is doubt. No, I, I don't believe her. And then the nature of the argument. You were arguing in the bar and on the... Also baby, doubt. This, this chick's just a dirty liar. Just a straight up dirty liar. And then partnership with the Sabo. Saved away. Um, that's that's just a straight up lie. With the truth. Not even doubt. We have evidence. Evidence against her. That's the insurance letter. And then after that, um, all you want to need to do is go into the den here to use the phone um, to get some more information. And then the that's going to take us to the coroner's office, come in here, and we talk to the coroner, a uh, quick report. little conversation yeah, with him, and that's gonna, there, there's where your the stab rate achievement will pop. And now we just need to go back to the Patterson house. Knock, 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 because, you know, they're, they're liars. Oh, we shot her, so let's take it off after Sabo. Um, you can get your warning shot here as a detective. Don't do it here. Um, and, or you can just shoot him. You're allowed to just shoot him. See, I, I tried to do it too soon, and I didn't keep it on him. So I'm going to be too far behind to do it. But uh, he's going to go up this hill. And he's already he's already out, out of my range. Yeah, I, uh, I can't believe I even kept up with him. But this is a good place to do it here. If you kept up with him going up this hill, you'd be able to aim him down the whole time. But if you donate them down, you get this cool little scene at the end. I like how my partner's going around. Where, where is he? He hasn't cut him off yet. Uh oh, uh oh, hostage, hostage. I like this one. I don't care. You don't want to do this, man. Put the weapon down. Boom! Right in the face. Oh, that's how we do it. Um, and that's the end of this case. Uh, GameGuideCentral.com, like I said, collectible videos, achievement videos, mission walkthroughs, we've got it all for you. Five stars. Yeah, and here's a here's a fun little bonus section where after I arrested him the first time, some lady just uh, hits me as I try to get in the car and kills me. Fun times, fun times.